I look at many machines, Graham, but this concept is new on me. Can you give me a little bit of an idea about well, what it is? Yeah, I mean, here we have the, uh, the Starmer MC538, and Starmer being part of the Chiron group. Um, both companies work very, very heavily into twin spindle, four spindle technology, uh, where we can get the highest level of output from one machine, um, and then reducing tack time within the parts. So essentially we've got two spindles here, but you, you could have four. Yeah, absolutely. Within Chiron and Starmer, we both offer their uh, four spindle versions as well. Here we have the new heavy-duty HSK100 uh, spindle here, now at a spindle distance of 600 centres, so we have the ability to handle much bigger parts than we've been able to do previously. And on this machine here, we're showing it with a 1300 bridge, the full clamping position uh, hydraulic fixture. So I'd be right in saying you, you're actually duplicating what you're doing with one spindle to the other, are you? They're not independent? No, they're not independent. Effectively here, where we got is, is coffee milling. So effectively, once the uh, the machine is set up, we're just looking at getting the level of productivity through there. They're not independent, but effectively, everyone who knows how to set up tooling on a twin spindle will get very, very high levels of quality. And is it as simple as saying somebody would buy one of these just because they want to double their output? Yeah, I think we're seeing in the in the UK, we're, we're having, going through a, a period of automotive is doing extremely well. So a lot of the top customers we're dealing with, uh, the volumes are increasing. We've got nice ability now to, to look at uh, Airbus programs, which are increasing massively as well. So between the two sectors, twin spindle technology, we are getting more requests to look at that. And what about your tool changer on this machine? And I know you mentioned briefly the working envelope, but what size of parts can you go up to? Yeah, well, I mean, here it depends uh, where we have four part load. So we have a 1300 bridge, so that then separates that into 640. But obviously we have to take into account the spindle distance of 600. So normally we just calculate the best fit, the best clamping arrangement. And then the tooling finally? The tooling, HSK100. Great thing about this machine, very, very heavy duty. Can do some very, very hard machining on here with a 400 newton meter spindle. And the amount of tool pockets? The standard machine is two times 20 or two times 32, but we can expand this out with background magazines up to 200. Fair to say, something different. Absolutely, and it's nice to see us having a Starmer here at the show. Brilliant, thanks, Greg. Cheers.